Are you guys tired of getting copyright strikes because your songs are copyrighted even though they claim to not be? Or are you tired of spending a bunch of time trying to find these songs on YouTube just to find nothing good? Well luckily I found a solution and this video is not sponsored by the way, it's just I found this website and I use it a lot. And it is free to use, but it's called Suno and you can create music and find music that's completely copyright free and use it for your videos and customize it to your liking so it's exactly what you want. So without further ado, let's get started. So the first thing you want to do is go to suno.com and it should look like this. You might have to sign up, but that's not a big deal at all. And yes, you do get free credits every day. I believe it's about 10 credits every day to make songs. And of course, if you want more than that, you're going to have to pay, but you can use this completely free if you want to. Because me personally, I make one or two songs and just keep reusing them, so you don't really need that many songs. But anyways, once you're at the website, you'll see the homepage looks like this and you'll be wondering what are all these boxes here, right? Well, they're actually songs that people have created with the software and you can hit play to hear what they sound like. But we're going to mainly focus on the create section right here. So go ahead and click on that and you'll see I've already made a bunch of songs and I actually use like two of these songs in like most of my most recent videos. So you can give it a listen right now. Now I'll show you guys how to make that on your own. So you'll see over here on the left, there's a lyrics box, custom, upload audio, etc, etc. Well, I'm going to be making an instrumental song, so check the instrumental box and it'll get rid of the lyrics. Now, if you wanted lyrics, you could type in what you want, like subscribe to Cambit, and it will say that in the song, which is really cool. But for my videos, I don't want any lyrics, so we're going to click instrumental. Now, the style of music is very important. This is where you type keywords of what you want your song to sound like. So me personally, I want 80s, I want synth and retro wave. You don't need a ton of keywords, by the way. And also there's a bunch of suggestions here if you want to get some ideas. So that's all I'm going to type. And the title doesn't matter. And I'm going to click create. It'll create two songs that will take some time to load. Now they are both pretty much done. So once you click play on one of them, you'll see here it says zero out of whatever. That's because the song is actually generating as I'm listening to it. And once it's done, you can download it, or if you want it to be longer, you can actually extend it. So I'm gonna let it play out and let it finish generating. I actually really like this one a lot, so I'm probably gonna use it for this video. Okay, so the song is actually done and it finished at three minutes and 54 seconds. So like I was saying, you can actually extend it. So if you go ahead and click this box right here and go to create, you can actually extend it or there's a bunch of other options as well. So we're going to extend it and then click extend right here. Now it should create two more versions that are extended, but I'm going to use this one right here. So I'm going to click on this box right here and create and click download MP3 audio. So now it'll download right here and I can use it in my editing software. Now you'll see down here, it says I have 2,475 credits. That's because I accidentally spent $100 on the software. And now I pretty much have unlimited credits, which I didn't intend to use this for making videos. I actually wanted to use it for just making random metal songs, but it actually came in handy because now I use it for all my videos. Now there's a bunch of other options in the software that you can explore. If you just start clicking through the menus, I'm sure you guys can find some really cool stuff. Like right here, you can pick a style by rolling the dice. Now, I don't know what this is, but there's so many options. It's actually pretty satisfying to just scroll through them all. But yeah, no, this software is super easy to use and it's really cool. So I recommend using it and don't get mad like, oh, it's paid, blah, 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 whatever, right? Because there is a free version and you can use it. Yes, it technically is free, but yeah, obviously there's a paid version, which I'd recommend if you make YouTube videos, just spend a few dollars and get a bunch of credits because you only really need a few to make a few songs and you can use those songs for a long time. I wouldn't recommend getting $100 worth because uh, I don't really need that many songs, <laughs> but I guess it's situational. Yeah, so you can see here the different plans. I guess I accidentally bought the pro plan, but now the basic plan, 10 songs daily. I mean, do you really need more than that? Now, if you're making 2000 songs monthly, I think you should switch careers because it seems like you want to produce music instead. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I hope it is useful to you guys. If you enjoyed it, leave a like and subscribe. Comment down below what other videos you guys want me to make. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.